Former American artistic gymnast Shannon Miller, who is in Mumbai for the Tata Mumbai Marathon, wants safety of athletes as the priority. The 1993-94 World All-Round Champion expressed her thought keeping the dangerous Produnova vault in mind. Um, I'm so excited to be here, to be the ambassador at the Tata Mumbai Marathon. I am just amazed at 55,000 people participating in, in this run, and it's just it really incredible to see how far it's grown and the importance of of running to health and, and wellness. Um, physical activity is such an important factor to our health. So, so to see so many people out here running, I'm just super excited for race day and to cheer everyone on. She has such incredible difficulty in her routines that they start at such a higher level um, than everyone else. So not only does she start from a, a more difficulty and in a higher score, um, she's able to perform them at, at such um, a consistent rate that um, it, it bodes well for her <laughs> for a lot of medals uh, in this year. Well, it, I mean, I think it depends on what skill you're talking about. Um, I think it's important in any sport to take um, as much precaution as you can to be as safe as possible for the athletes. I think safety always has to come first. <laughs> well, you know, it's, it's important, I think, to um, kind of plan for that. Now, I think we have athletes that have shown that you don't have to finish all that early. Um, so, I mean, there's still, there's still um, athletes that competed when I did in 1992, and they're still competing at the top of their game. So, um, so I think that's important to, to know that you can have longevity in the sport. But at the same time, um, for many athletes that are finishing at an early age um, because of you know, the sport or, or due to injury or, or anything else, um, to have that plan, I think for me, education was helpful because I had school to go back to. I was starting with my college degree, and so that kind of helped me, um, gave me time to kind of figure out what I was going to do with the rest of my life. But but it's important to be able to talk about it and, um, and to have people to talk to about it. There's no handbook for what do you do after you retire from sport. Um, so it's, it's really important to be able to talk about it and, and to be able to have um, access and, um, and knowledge of, of those things that, that can help you.